And that's everybody. And then next one is the angel that Ray and and Shinji fought together. As I don't know how my um, uh, barrier is going to take this. オープン。So on my turn, we're going to finish this bad boy off. Only two. Direct attack. No, oh, that's defense. Don't me. Fine, I can work with this. But since I haven't seen this attack yet already. Alright. Now we're taking this one. So apparently, the defensive system for this is the same as the uh, forms, or the uh, option of the defensive their name is. Oh, that, that just killed it. Never mind. But from, uh, anyway, from uh, our type. Well, that just, just killed it in one hit. up one, Kauru levels up one, Kauru does, Kauru can't, doesn't get score, so he can't ace. Something changed inside me after I fought that angel. I like to feel Akari's warmth again. All enemies confirmed destroyed. The garden must have wanted to take, use this chaos to take everyone by surprise. I'm sorry, I was using the wrong accent there. The garden must have wanted to use this chaos to take everyone by surprise. Those guys are after Yamato and Nine. So they, looks like they didn't know what was going on here at all. Those guys feel really creepy somehow. I agree. I'm not sure how to put it. Partly because we don't know what they want, but somehow they just seem kind of... gross. Right, exactly. Like a gut reaction to dislike them. Well, if we want to get to Iskandar. We absolutely need the Yamato. Can't let them take it. And if we want to prevent the fusion of the U of the UC and AD dimensions, and save Earth in the new correct century dimension, we have to cross the dimensional barriers. We will open to those who don't lose hope. I know you all will be able to save the world. Shinji, would it be okay if I joined you on your journey? 
Would you come with us, Kaoru? Wherever you go, I will gladly follow. I'm gonna gladly join you. What is all that about? Does it bother you? What? 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 Who, me? Who cares about Baka Shinji? Oh, now I get it. Well, it certainly doesn't get boring around you all. Beat. Commander Akari. Captain Katsuragi. Later, would you come to my room with Shinji? Yes. Commander, you just called you call Shinji by his name. You didn't call him, just call him Unit 01 pilot. Maybe I should believe just a bit more. Commander Akari, and our meager hopes. Attack points! I should have deployed... Um, they turn three. Because it was an ace bonus. After considering Command Dr. Akagi's report, I've concluded that Unit 01's transformation was unconnected to space time fusion, and we may continue using it. We may go on allowing Unit 00, 01, and 02 to work in cooperation with Lando Bell. And we can add Unit 08 as well. What about Unit 13? I will leave the decision of which unit the pilots will use to you news to you, as you will be on site. Understood. Shinji. Yes? You did well. Uh-huh? Our success in defending nerve from the 9th and 10th Angels is due, uh, due in large part to your work. Father, you will have to fight again. Before that, I'd like you to come somewhere with me. Where to? To your mother's grave. Oh, you'd rather not. No, I'll go. In return, I'd like you to do something with me. What's that? After, once things have calmed down, I'd like to enjoy some of Ayanami's homemade miso soup with you. Okay. Thank you, Father. You don't have much time left. You're leaving in an hour. I know. I'll go get ready. Very well, then, Commander. If you'll excuse me. Am I doing the right thing, Yui? I like to think that Gendo's finally having some doubts after this whole situation. There we go. All of the ace mis ace briefings that have been kind of stacking up after things have gone to crap. <clears throat> Congratulations on becoming an ace pilot, Banjo. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. Man, I knew it all out to celebrate, building the set and all. What's the idea behind this? I really want to learn a little about what it takes to be a strong pilot from the master himself. Hmm, that's a good question. But to be honest with you, I don't think I'm quite ready to discuss that with anyone yet. Oh, why not? Because they still have a lot of room for improvement. Think about it. I talk about my using, I'm using the sun's power a lot. That's not enough for me. I want to be the sun for people in my life one day and brighten their lives as best I can. A fair point. Thank you for talking with me today. I think I'm starting to get what make, makes you strong after all. Congratulations on becoming an ace pilot, Tetsuya. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. You know, that has a nice ring to it, ace pilot. I get used to this real fast, I, I reckon. Where did you where did you suddenly come from the American South? Or a cowboy? I reckon. Anyway, thanks for having me over at nine. It's nice to be able to celebrate it like this. I guess whoever wrote my dialogue decided I, I'm kind of a cowboy with this bandana and everything, so I'm just going to roll with it. If that's unusual, I'm not used to seeing you look so pleased with yourself. Right. You're not wrong, but look at it like this. I've just devoted, about devoted my whole life to being a pilot. Can I get the rec recognition for my hard work? It just feels nice, you know? I suppose I do, yes. Still, I think this might be the first time I've seen you smile. Could you, could you stop looking at me so much, Nine? You're starting to make me feel embarrassed. My apologies, of course. I'll stop. I really wanted to save your smile to my memory banks while I could. You're, re you're one real... Ah, you're really one of a kind, Android Nine. You know that? I don't know any others that could recognize emotions. Thank you. I still have much to learn, but I try. Next, I believe we have... Riddy! Congratulations on becoming an ace pilot, Riddy. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. I'm honored that you'd want to celebrate my own accomplishments, but to be frank, I'm not sure that sure I've really done anything to merit it. And to be frank, I'm not that sure I really understand your sentiments that well. However, what I can say is that you wouldn't be back here again if it, 
were it not for your resolve and determination. I get the feeling you've grown since we last talked. I could say the same about you, but with you having joined forces with a bunch of former Titans and G-Hound to fight against us, uh, getting mind whammied by the Gundam Unicorn Banshee, and then regaining control with the help of uh, Banagher and joining back forces to our side. You really think so? You're not just saying that? I really do think so. It's clear to me that you've gotten stronger through a lot of struggling and hardship. If you say so, thanks, Nine. I'll try not to let you down going forward. Captain Murray! Ah! This is pretty good. I, I, I'm looking forward to when I finally get Ray aced because I'm kind of interested to see what the conversation is going to be like. Hmm. Congratulations on becoming an ace pirate, Captain, pilot, Captain Murray. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. Thanks, Nine. But I make being dubbed an ace pilot as a ship captain feels a little unnatural to me. I had the same thought as well. Both being included sounded better something than like, like say, ace captain. Well, you did the, well, you did the best with what you've got. I'm sure flat. I'm still flattered that you put on a nice celebration for me. I suppose now is as good a time as any to thank you for all your service to all of us. Your constant support day in and day out make, really makes our lives a lot easier. Aww. Don't mention it, I'm simply doing my job. Bob or not, what you do is still really important, so thanks for everything, Nine. You were always so nice to me, Captain. Why is that? It's really hard to articulate it. I, so on some level, I just feel we sp share a special bond, the two of us. Special? How so? Like I said, it's hard to explain. But as I watch you grow up, I guess, and learn things, I feel a certain sort of pride. It makes me happy to see you grow. Keep doing what you're doing, Nine. You're doing great. Thank you, Captain. I keep to hear you say do that. I'll keep, I'll keep doing me, I promise. Asuka! <laughs> this is interesting. Congratulations on becoming an ace pilot, Asuka. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. I don't get what the big deal is. Of course I'm an ace. I can't say I'm surprised to hear that from you. Really? Yes, you tend to be a very predictable person. Hm, you're just an AI. What would you know? It's true. I don't know everything. Well, they had noticed your expression has changed a lot lately. Huh? What makes you say that? I think it's because you're changing as a human being. In a good way, I mean. You, you really get that impression about me? I do. I can know it to be true how, based on how you reacted just now. Previously, you would have vehemently denied you were changing at all. Maybe you're right. Nowadays, how do I put it? I guess I don't hate myself the way I used to. But maybe it's easier for me to accept what you're saying. It makes me happy to see you smile. It's nice to be able to talk with you when you're in a good mood. <laughs> yeah, I think so too. It just comes with me a lot more easily than it used to before. And Shinji is next. Yep. Congratulations on becoming an ace pilot, Shinji. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. None of this feels real to me. I can't believe I'm actually an ace pilot. Well, I, for one, believe you've earned it due to your hard work and gut and determination. Almost said hard work and guts there, but that's an earlier Gynax Super Robot anime. You should be proud. That makes one of us. I'm not sure. Well, I am. Trust me. I'll take your word for it, then. Thanks, Nine. I feel a little more confident now. I'm glad to hear it. I hope you can use this newfound confidence to improve your relations with women. Er, wh what? What does that matter to you? You have a history of being pessimistic. You have a history of being, pes just, ah, you have a history of being pessimistic towards people. But this change in attitude, especially with respect to women, could prove to be useful in my research. Of course, I'll always respect your privacy. I don't intend to intrude in your my life too much as I survey you. Oh God, this line. Okay. <clears throat> okay, let's, let's see. Let's try to handle this. It's in. Nine's voice while keeping a straight face. <clears throat> but enough talk, Shinji. I think you have the fit you to get some. I'm sure it's only if you take the initiative when dealing with a woman, much like when you shank an angel, you'll. Ah! Runs away. Oh, Shinji, what am I going to do with you? 
Nine, you've been hanging out with Kurtz too long. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> that line. Oh my god, that line. <laughs> <laughs> My nice characterization is somewhat all over the map. But that is the kind of line that screams, I've been hanging out from... I've been monitoring Kurtz way too long for my own good. <laughs> <clears throat> Running is all well and good, but if you need to run... But if you need to run two women... Oh, but you need to run two women rather than away if you're going to get anywhere. So this is the ship carrying our hopes. And you are? I'm Karu Nagisa. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm not asking your name, but I'd like to know what exactly you are. You'll have to figure that out for yourself. It'd be good for you. It might find, it might help you find success in all this. I think he might be right. By simply trying to analyze his presence and that spear, my tactical processing capacity has earned data equal to 500 pack points. The truth about that Eva, you like chasing after that mystery, is going to be very valuable to me. Oh, you have no idea. Alright, now, suborders, I've got to do this last time, and that's, that's on me. briefings today. Unplug my headphones. Hang on. Oh, oh. Sorry, my cat got tangled up near my headphone cable. My check, check. Good, we're good. Okay. Uh, the second attack, but he does not have. Let's give him full counter. Let's get him to, I actually think he's got full counter already. Who doesn't? All right, so that works. Full counter is actually that's really worth giving to the real ro robot pilots, just because they are squishier, but deal a lot of damage, so getting them able to put in that first hit is really, really useful. The attack as well. Those okay, and we have one more, two more Ace Pilot dialogue scenes. Congratulations on becoming an Ace Pilot Amaro. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. Well, for the record, piloting's all I'm good for, and I'd say you're all you're good for is criticizing yourself. Ouch, that stung a little nine, but point taken. I think that new types of humans really aren't just made to be tools of war. There's much more to life than both for both of them. I definitely agree with that, yeah. Knowing that, I want to ask you a question. Could you tell me about what lies within the deepest reaches of human emotions? You mean... I'm talking about love, yes. Sorry, no, Nine. I'm not giving up much help there. Love's one of my bigger weak points. 
I've gotten older and maybe a little wiser, but I still have a lot of stuff like love to figure out. Which perhaps shows the level of wisdom of Amaro there. I mean, he's figured out that... Like, oh, at this point, he's, he's figured out, okay, Brownbow was carrying a torch for me, but I threw that away. Um, maybe Sayla was holding a torch for me, but I threw that away, too. There's Belchorka, and um, there's your other co-pilot, who's just aim on my head right now. Even though multiple women have feelings for you? Jeez, you don't pull your punches, do you? I appreciate that Amaro is like... But Amaro, everyone else, whenever the love question comes up, they get super duper flustered. Amaro's like, yeah, I, I suck on this topic. Congratulations on becoming an ace pilot, Vivian. I'm sure you worked very hard to get to this point. Thanks, Nine. Did you make all this? It's awesome. I did, but now it's, as you often say, this time. Oh my, how the tables have turned. All right, Nine, what's your question? I just know I'll ace it. I hope so. Here it is. What is love? Oh, baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me no more. That is the answer to that question. Holy, wow, girl, you could have picked a harder question to kick things off. Hard or not, a question is a question. What's your answer? Hmm, what's the easiest way to put it? Take your time. We're in no rush. I think love isn't something that can't be taught. It's just you have to go, go out and find it for yourself somehow. Thank you, Vivian. That's a very good answer. It's clear I still have a lot of research ahead of me. It's also definitely, like, that's also probably the more insightful answers people have given in response to this. And it's interesting that Vivian is the character who gave that response. It's like she's, she's murder, murder silent Bob or something. Wow, that was enough to satisfy her? I thought she wanted something more specific as an android, but hey. <laughs> All right, and to get a bunch of cash to spend on upgrades, let's do that again. Um... Let's upgrade Unicorn Gundam, boost your armor, and your accuracy. Because I know I kind of have a better understanding of some of the elements of the system here, but okay. HP is good, but so is accuracy. What do I have that doesn't have an equip to it? Black Getter doesn't well, only Ryoma can pilot the Black Getter. Only Sauce can pilot Bulk to Delta Plus. Ah, this one has people I can assign people to. You'll know. Rizel. Mondo. There you go. Indo and Mondo now have robots. F91 has production type. Maybe a lot of people could have that, but everyone who uses it is currently piloting something right now. Maybe one is currently vacant because everyone is on. Because he is piloting Eva Unit 13 with um, Kauru. Alright, the special. I can buy one more of the special ability. And bot. Um. Or actually, beginning of your player phase. Huh. Uh, SP recovery sounds really worth getting. Um. Where's Ray? You don't have that skill, you are getting it now. Because after that mission, you really, really need SP recovery. 
Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. Uh, toss me a few bucks, also helps support the show, and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that. 